clap my hands once to get a free in that position. My name is Genevieve Clay-Smith and I'm the co-founder of uh, Bus Stop Films. So Bus Stop is a not-for-profit organisation that um, helps people with a disability get involved in filmmaking. And we've been holding our workshops for three years now at Sydney Community College. we got funding to do another film and this time um, we really wanted to explore imagery, visual metaphor, poetry and dance and the students were able to be very collaborative and work together in coming up with an idea for an experimental film and so we started off with creative development workshops. Uh, we told a few more stories around some of the photos you brought in so the photos were to do with friendship or relationships so it could be between family members, could be between a pet, could be a best friend, could be a friend that you don't see anymore, or a friend that's passed away. Um, so we might hear from a few people's um, stories then now. So who wants to go first? Well, I chose trust because it's very important to me. Trust is everything. If you don't have trust, you don't have relationships. The first movement was bullying. Yep. That was hers. And the second one movement was her doing the shopping and me being the boyfriend and me being suspicious of her doing some devious stuff. I picked heartbreak because I think it's important um, like when it comes to loving someone for a long time sometimes you sort of feel like you want to break out with them and, and um, yeah. Um, I've chose friendship the word because I didn't have any good friends at my old school when we were living in the same suburb we moved to Stratfield because I had good friends in Rock they did take as well another one in Ultimo the words I picked is connection and honesty I picked love is because if you for, for example for my parents and I we should so why we can be knowing to each other, we should like show the love that we've had, we've got, and that sometimes it's not good to hide the love you have. And basically, what happened is lots of themes to do with relationships came up. The themes have evolved around heartbreak and a lot of things to do with loss and um, love. And so we came up with this concept of creating an experimental short film all about uh, the pain and joy of relationships. Love is a smoke raised with a few of sounds. I want to say, um, what was it? It's it's a, a, it was a fantastic job. Try not to it too slowly. But the one thing I need to suggest mm -hmm. is that you try and use more body language oh, yeah. and show it more. What's been your favourite part of the process? Looking at the sky, at all the whole wheelers looking at the sky, they, they look good. That was so interesting. Yeah. Yeah. The last question is, have you had any fun making this film? Yes, it was so good. I was so proud of myself, so that was so good. Yeah. It's hard to get someone to love you, but I think it's worth fighting for. Uh, I can't wait to start the film in September, in the yeah. middle of September. And once it's done, a lot of people will probably see it.
because I've actually done, used to do acting when I was younger and I just find trying to use an old talent of mine just to show that disabled people can do it and not to let people think or oh, they shouldn't let disabled people join in but just include them. One of them did like that. And, that. and so instead, and one of them did. One of them did front like towards the camera. Like to, one of them both right towards the camera. Yeah, okay, both towards the camera. Okay, I'll let them know. we did the interviewer, um, it was very much focused on behind the scenes and everybody had to choose a role that they wanted to learn about behind the camera. In this process it was open, we said what do you want to do? Now most of the class wanted to act and three wanted to direct. So we split the class up, um, everybody had a theme to explore and then I assigned um, the three directors, uh, Libby, Robin and Nathan to uh, different themes and different actors. My name is Robin. I'm the director of my theme Sisterhood and Friendship. I'm very excited and also very a bit nervous about what's going to happen. How's it going? It's going good. Yeah? Enjoying every minute of it. Alright, here we go. Let's roll up. Five, take one. Cool. Alright, here we go. You did it! You did it! Awesome work! Looked beautiful. Must be a proud moment for Dad too. I think so. Pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. So Jared's theme is love. We're gonna have him like looking after the scout hall like it's um, it's his job as it, like he does the maintenance here. And so he's just having a usual afternoon, stuck in the chairs, tidying up, sweeping and then all of a sudden he bursts out into a Shakespeare uh, monologue. 74 take two tail slate. And action! Oh, the life, the, the life scene? Yeah. Is this the scene you're acting in it? Yes, I am. You're solo on this whole scene, right? Yes, it is. Means you're directing without Jen? Yes, that's true. Can't wait to see your stuff. You're gonna love it. These are our amazing, this is the directing team of the film. These guys did an amazing job because a lot of the hard work happened before we went on set, didn't it? Mm -hmm. What What did we do? Well, for me, I had to plan out what moves my actor was going to do. And it was a bit rough, but in the end, I got there. I had to do yep. Natalie and Trish to do a sisterhood. And that was to partly to do with, like, when your sister, your older sister, take it. Uh, she moves out of home and as the younger sister, how she feels inside herself. Okay, well I just directed um, a moving piece. You did it with who? David and the real dancer. Rob. Rob, Rob yes, yes. Rob, Rob too, because you were Rob one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I learned about the, the script and, and the clipboard. And when, um, I learned acting was so good and yeah. Okay, uh, what, what I like was learning about what makes a film a film 
and that um, and I'm being honest there, it's a lot about patience, punctuality, and it's a lot about teamwork as well. I learned to be a good actor, and um, I need to learn how to dance a little bit. What did I learn? To be a good sister, and to be a good friend to everyone. Please film class. Thank you. I really hope that um, you know, Bus Stop would be able to stand on its own and um, be bigger and better and maybe even do workshops overseas and, and get people involved in inclusive filmmaking all around the world. Great.